Oh yeah, I just remembered what uh, I'm thinking to myself like, huh, which container do I not have? And it's the one in Armadillo stages. Armadillo stage. The one I can get, I could have gotten earlier if I was actually good enough, but I'm not good enough. I need like, I need the tornado because it does damage over time fast enough to the machine that I can jump. I don't. It doesn't break the, the wall faster than I can jump. That's the whole point. All right. And with the armor on, it's kind of hard for me to lose to him. And with all of his health. Fire's oil and fire. An interesting boss. Don't even look at you when I finish you, bro. You're not on my radar screen. Fire wave. You got fire wave. Actually, this is the only time you will ever get to see X in full armor. Because you can't. Certain certain ones you. Those. Finally! We found Sigma's fortress. Let's go in and put an end to his war against the humans. Let's go in and put an end to his war against the humans. There you go, Zero. The hero. Let me jump in here real quick. Oh yeah, that's right. I have two hearts. To get. Not just this one. I already got the heart in here. There's an E-tank in here. The heart I'm thinking of is the one in Armor Bill stage. And... The one in... Oh, I in my head a second ago. Stink, not stinking, but that's me. It's the one... Sorry. You need one thing at a time for one, instead of a thousand things at one time. That's everything in this stage. Oh yeah, Boomer Coiner. Get the heart here as well. Actually, I should save this for last. Wait, no. I should actually do it now. Because I don't know... I wanted that health. I want that life. I wanted that life so badly. Okay, so this is the first machine. Block destroyer. It makes you feel like playing Super Metroid. Did I say that already? This game makes me feel like doing a lot of things. This game just makes me think about the 90s in general. A lot of things make me think about the 90s in general. Vector Man also being one of them, which I will also probably get really nostalgia about because I beat Vector Man 1 a lot. Mega Man is basically the Sega Genesis variant of Mega Man. 
Although, he doesn't have 8 Robot Masters, but he does have, like... Does it have 8 levels? Uh, I think he has 8 levels. He might have more. Don't quote me on that. I'm probably more knowledgeable at Vector Man, at Vector Man as a game than I am at this game, but... I might be more intimate with this game now because of all the lore and back story that goes along with them. the series as a whole. Tearing through this guy. Oops. Need to have all items anyway to get the last thing in that stage. And I need, I need the final upgrade to quickly defeat and beat this game. It's like, you don't need it, it's like, yeah, but I feel like I, like, 100%ing this game goes hand in hand with like, the whole idea of like playing it so that people can see what the game is about and like why it's fun. Because once you've gotten good enough, you can like really like you can start speedrunning this game. I am not a speedrunner, but I am inspired by speedrunners to play games quickly. But also having as much fun as possible and uh, possibly 100%ing the game if you can. I like doing that a lot in RPGs, which you'll see with a lot of games that I'm going to play. Like all, all the games in my head, guys. Oh man, so many, so many great moments coming. So many great moments to watch me fail. But I'm going to try and reduce the failure in terms of like losing footage from now on. But I'm also going to like post so often that it's going to like make your head spin. Because I want to try and get as much stuff done. Because like I have a whole idea about what I want to do for October. Because I'm not really a big scary fan, scare guy. I'm not really into horror. But there are games that I think suit a guy like me for those kinds of months. Bloodstained and Castlevania being some first hints. Bokdai and Devil May Cry being others. You know, I like a, I like a good, I like being good. I like being a monster hunter. I mean, heck, that's the thing too, right? Like, when I run out of uh, spooky games that I can play on the October, the October uh, runs, um, I can start playing pseudo scary games or just like monster games, like Monster Hunter. It's like it's a monster mash. Or yeah, like even mo like even like Pokemon, like Pokemon and Digimon are like. Halloween-esque, especially with Digimon. Digimon has a lot of Halloween-esqueness going on about it. Nice. So I have all of the... I think that's it. All I'm going to have to do now is head on over to this stage. Now I have as much health as a boss, because I am a boss. I'm a big boy. I used to take more damage coming in here. Now you guys can barely scratch me. life. This is how you're supposed to play this level. Expertly. I 
This is what complete mastery of the game does to you. This is what happens when you fully have control over Mega Man X. You understand everything about the game, you understand how to get everything. This is what whole power fulfillment. And it's like, not that big of a rush to me anymore. But as a kid, getting to this point inside this game on your own terms, man, it's rewarding. Feels good. I mean, beating the game in any facet, no matter how you do it, since there's like already a plethora of ways that you can do it, but like getting to this state and being able to say that you finished the game in this state. Destroying you, destroying you, my guy. For no other reason than that, because I can. I wonder if that had been enough to jump. Like, physics works differently for different kinds of, like... You have to get the capsule, and you have to die a few times. I don't know, he's very durable. It's only your buster shop that functions correctly. I wonder if that means it's like the strongest weapon technically. Beautiful waterfalls in the mountainside region. Seems so meticulous. This is literally uh, the electrical shocker used by Electro Man in Mega Man 1. It's literally the same idea. Uh, it's, it, it's frame data work, looks and works, like works the same. Or is that Mega Man 2 or 1? But anyway, e like Man, uh, if you pause the screen or whatever, while you're using his electrical attack, it keeps doing multiple damage, so you only have to use it like once or twice. It's super good for like most enemies in the game. Wow. See like that's that's how easy he's supposed to be with just the buster shot. But I can't, I don't have the rapid fire required anymore to, to do the damage necessary. That's so cool. Meow, 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 meow. Meow, meow, 
reset the the whole secret thing. Mm. Hopefully it didn't. Because you're supposed to lean, not supposed to need full health anyway. So I don't think it's like it should matter what your error rate is. I'm sure you're tired of seeing me destroy this robot, but it's all for a good cause. Very worthy upgrade. Very good secret. Not very well hidden anymore. Most people know about it, and if you don't, don't feel bad. Darn it, I think I, I, think I screwed up by dying. Because it would have, it should have worked. Pretty sure I have all of the. Oh, I don't have all the hearts. That's why it didn't work. I forgot. I didn't come back here after I got Flame Mammoth. I literally had to stare at Pe Chill Penguin stage and realize, like, oh yeah, that's right. Idiot. It's not working. It's not not working. You didn't. You didn't hold your end of the bargain. Now everyone can see you not be as cool as you said you were. Ugh, now you look like even twice the moron. So stupid. Why am I so stupid? Future me. Cut out a clip of Caleb's Why Am I So Stupid video in here. If you don't, I'm gonna be very upset at you. I don't have, I don't have an editor yet. So one day. One day. I, would, I would love it one day if I could have an editor. I guess it takes a moment to make my videos and not make not those jokes. This home stretch. E tanks are full. Don't actually have to care about any of this.
Do I beat up? Ah, uh, uh, I was trying to kill him before. I was like, can I destroy him before he even gets there? I just wanted to see if I could kill him and then get the container. I mean, you can do that. It just happened a second ago with someone else, but we couldn't. Oh, see, yeah. I love that. It destroys and gives you back. This is a funny thing. It's like, why didn't you laugh? It's like, well, it's, you know, like an inner kind of funny thing. Oh my gosh. It's like, give you back stuff? Why would anyone use anything else? Interested in any damage, guys? I gotta get, I gotta get the capsule. I apparently do. <laughs> I gotta get the capsule. I apparently do. Take some of notes of what you say when you're recording it. It's so insane. I sound like a crazy person when you're talking to a microphone sometimes. All the time. Every time. Just walking over your corpse, bud. I can't do it again when it's on while it's on screen. Such an oddity. Oh, just can't die. I mean, like, it should be appearing now. As long as I don't do anything dumb, like, get myself killed. Contrarily. Ow. Should be happening now. Can't remember if it needs you to be on your last life or something. Hmm. These don't seem to do any more damage. Oh, okay. Well, all that and two tornadoes. <laughs> Spectacle. Ah, uh, yeah, you just need to be on your last leg. I give you a special present. Now enter the capsule, please. Please trust as you do. 
Wonder what I wonder what happens now. Now I can do the Hadouken. Become now I am the storm. Now I am the storm. Okay, I'm gonna save here. I'm gonna take a brief cut break. And then we'll be back in just a memento. Okay. Okay. Take a break. Take a little break. Drink some water. Ready. Let's split up. I'll go in first, and then you can slip in while I keep the main parts of the horse busy. Sigma because I didn't realize that dying not getting the Hadoken was faster was the fastest way and just dying over and over was the fastest way just to get back to um, fighting Sigma. So I've learned a lot. I've learned a lot playing the game. I recommend anybody who's doing a let's play always always try and practice first. I get some playthrough, some test playthrough in first. It's always good to to practice before you uh, do a main thing, rehearsals. Like make sure like the game you're playing is not just something that you're good at, but something you like a game that you would enjoy playing. And by the by the first part, I don't think I was enjoying playing X. I was uh, I was just playing it because I I know a lot about the game game is very familiar to me. And, uh, 